The following is an instructional video which explains how to assemble the Multi-Chair 4000 TX. The first step is to unpack all the parts from the included carrying case. Then unfold the seat frame and slide and tighten the slide bolts using the included T-handle Allen wrench. Then you'll want to install the four legs. Note the rear legs have an offset elbow. Position these legs at a 45 degree angle relative to the frame and mate the small pins of the offset pieces into the corresponding holes in the frame. The front legs will have a footrest insertion clamp already installed. The top of each leg should fit easily into leg bore holes and make sure the legs are fully inserted. For ease of future leg height adjustment, position the front legs so the adjustment holes are facing outwards. Then tighten the legs in place using the T-handled Allen wrench. After all four legs are installed, turn the chair right side up and install the back post and arms. There is a right and a left post. Slide the back post into the rear holes on the upper seat frame. Each of the posts has an internal clamp that tightens the posts in place. Prior to tightening, make sure that the saddles with small anti-rotational semicircles drop in the corresponding feature on the frame. Once in place, tighten the internal post clamps using the T-handled Allen wrench. The next step is to slip on the cloth back by sliding the cantilever arms through the windows of the cloth back. Then wrap the sides around the back post and secure it in place with a Velcro on the back post. Then snap the Velcro straps together. Adjustments can be made to the strap lengths allowing for some adjustment in cloth tension and back angle. The final step is to insert the footrest assemblies. The angle and height can be adjusted if necessary using the T-handled Allen wrench. The Multi-Chair 4000 TX is now assembled and ready for use. The packing items in the T-handled Allen wrench with the instructions should be stowed in the carrying case for safekeeping and future use.